Oh, what's this? What's all this then? Hello. BB. <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome back to Evil Land Legendary Edition. Time to get back in the thick of things. And <laughs> we finally skipped the forest. Also, if you guys like the video, please like and subscribe. That helps so much. Helps. I, I just finished recording the Supreme Commander video and it was stressful. <laughs> I'm a little stressed. <laughs> okay. So what was I doing? I'm trying to remember. Alright, we talked to the dude. Um, thank you for helping my son escape. Even the Melania is eternally grateful to you. We must find a way to contact Lothair. We must avoid this disaster. So you're like a superhero, but you're human. Weird. Humans and demons being friends? How naive. So the way you treat me different now? I will never trust humans again. Not after that attack in the middle. Okay. I, I already heard that. Okay. People go away. Oh my gosh, I'm so... I got a whiplash from... Playing Supreme Commanders. <laughs> uh, okay. We're going north. To the thing. Pretty sure, right? Yeah. Ooh, it's all quiet. It's all... Here's the Magalith I spoke of. That's definitely Magalith. It has the same symbols etched into it as the one that brought us here. But then, I don't know how to activate it. Activate it? Magaliths are nothing more than the monuments of the ancient Magi civilization. They do not serve, serve any purpose. What was that? Oh, that's not good. Dead! The vampire! The sorcerers are attacking the camp! What?! How in the world did they find us? Find them! A member of the Demonian and Royal family must get away. Fucked up, man. Bro, I'm about to smack you so hard. Ah, there you are. The great Magus. Run away, son, run! Minos Demonia, son of King Arthas, general and heir to the throne. I have to thank you. I have you to thank for this. Me? No. How did you? How did I follow you? No, it wasn't that hard. Although I didn't think you would make it through the haunted forest. But when you did survive, all it took to track you down was guessing where you would exit from. And here I am! What have I done? This is all my fault. Oh, don't fret now. You won't have to despair much longer. Watch out! Whoa. You hit the Magulus. Huh? Um. Oh. Oh, oh this is new. All three of us just went in it. What? They disappeared? How could that be? Find them! They can't be very far. What just happened? Holy shit. Bro, this game's dope. <clears throat> oh. Hello there. Okay, this is really weird. Hello! Well, what the heck were you doing here? You weren't taking advantage of my being... Where are we anyway? The Magalith. Activated when the sorcerer destroyed it. Means we're back home. Well, I hope I have this strange feeling of volume. It's like that day I ate too much chocolate, but without the stomach ache. Don't you have the same feeling, Danziel? <laughs> it's odd. None of us had chocolate mousse. Yes. Okay. Anyway, enough about this chocolate mousse thing. You got some volume, all right. <laughs> the magnets will no longer work. Um, then we traveled in time a little bit. That dude's like fucking um, Manos. Oh wow. Hell of a, hell of a big boy. Where have the sorcerers gone? My son, how is he? There's something around your neck. Menos. Actually, it's a bit complicated. Where should I begin? What do you mean, complicated? They're all dead, is that it? Well... Hold on, let me explain. We're... We're not in the same time as before. Enzo and me come from the present. I mean, for you, it's the future. But to us, your present is our past. I'm not sure I'm being very clear. I did not understand a thing. They're all dead, is that what you are trying to tell me? 
In a way, yes. Or maybe they're just older. I refuse to continue this conversation. I must find my son and save my father. I think I'm gonna need a new approach. We can't leave him alone, Danzio. Alrighty then. That was so cool it lagged my computer. Okay, let's try it again. Okay, there we go. It's not lagging anymore. <laughs> my CPU usage like just spiked. Alright. So cool. I can't get over how... Oh, this is... Oh, yeah. Oh, it's fluid. Menos. The year 950 of our lord. Here were the demons vanquished by Emperor Lothair and his troops. The inscription on this statue. How is this possible? I was trying to say, to explain Menos. The Maglith, we traveled through time. Denzel and I come from year 999, almost 50 years after the demons were defeated. <clears throat> An accident led us to your time, and the Empire captured us. When the Great Magus destroyed the Maglith, something came out of it. I think that thing brought us here. I really wish we'd return home. I get the feeling we're in a different time period. All this seems impossible. And yet, this statue... But, why? What is the meaning of our lives if everything is already written? I don't understand it much myself. But look at Danziel. He continues to fight no matter what. At first I was terrified at the thought of being lost. While following Danziel, I began to understand. Life is just right, just right now, this very moment, wherever you happen to be. I don't know if the past has already happened or the future can be changed. I know I exist right here, right now. It's just me in the here and now. And Danziel is the one who made me realize that. I'm not afraid anymore. Although rats and mushrooms still do it, of course. <laughs> I'm not convinced. My people have been conquered. And I shouldn't be here. My son, what has become of him? Instead of asking ourselves all these questions, we'd be better off looking for another Magalith. If you're able to go back into the past, then you should be able to return to your own time. Let's focus on that instead of dwelling on questions we can't answer. Hey, don't sound... Don't I sound like an adult, Danziel? Ha <laughs> I don't know if I can be as strong as Mega Clink or Miss Fina. But I'll do my best. I like it, it calls me Mega Clink, it's great. Very cool. Bro, this game... Really good. Very, very good. <clears throat> BB's temp. <coughs> oh, what's this? What's all this then? Hello. BB. <laughs> That's a total knockoff on Bobbity. No, not Bobbity, uh. I forgot the old lady in Dragon Ball. Uh, what a fine young man you are. Folks call me Ran Granny BB. But I've got the heart of a young woman. Besides, I'm not really that old. But anyways, feel free to invite me out some evening. We could go out for potions, maybe more if you feel a spark. Whoa. Speaking of potions, what can I do for you, darling? Buy a potion. I hope you brought me some good stuff. Oh, I'm supposed to give something. What do you want me to do with that? My BFG... My, B <laughs> My BFG 9000? What can I do for you, darling? Green goop. Green BB's gonna fix you a real nice potion. What's a green goop? Green potion restores half your HP. Nice. Very cool. Think of me when your pretty lips touch the bottle. <laughs> what can I do for you, darling? This is weird. You brought me the good stuff, my sweet gummy bear. What the ore? What does that do? What do you want me to do with that? My BFG 9000? Old sword. Right, is there anything we can do with anything? Gravity. Why is the, the apple named Gravity? Well, because of that. <laughs> the thing. Oh, wait. What did I give him? I gave a red thing. Red potion restores all of your HP. Ooh. I don't remember what I put in there. It was a uh, sugar. Okay, nothing you can do with sugar. Okay, what's that do? Wake an ally. Awakening if you bring me enough mana. That's mana, that's life, energy, extremely rare stuff. And even then, if the woken individual isn't ready to accept the awakening, they'll die. At any rate, you're short on mana. Come back later, my love starved vampire. What can I do for you? Okay. You see my rubber ducky. Okay. Weird. Very weird. I think so. Pretty good. Alright. Go this way. Haunted forest. If you bump into the boss, don't judge him by his appearance. 
Some people call him a monster, but that's because they don't know him. Anyway, he takes good care of us. Without him, we'd just be run-of-the-mill thieves. Ah, a new recruit. Don't you worry, this job is real easy. We just find the stuff that's been banned in the capital and resell it to people who want it. It's not too dangerous, as long as you don't get caught by the militia, of course. Can't hurt the tree, feels bad. It's kinda weird having the pixelated art in the back. Whoa. Crazy. I feel like the one dude can probably... Yeah, that's probably where I need to go, but I need I want to break this. Didn't work. Sounds. Hello. I used to live in Genova. My dream was to become a traitor. But I quickly learned that only traitors' sons become traitors. So then I came here. You think about it. Our work is kind of like what traitors do. True and... Yeah, that's pretty true. That's true and... Yeah, that's true. That's true. That's true. That's pretty true. That's pretty true. I mean... That's true. I guess. <laughs> Don't say anything bad about the boss. He's our savior. Many of us are sons of pirates. Long ago, a volcano erupted on our island. The boss took us in and taught us a new trade. The boss grew up here, so he's very attached to the forest. Personally, I found it a bit gloomy at first, but I got used to it eventually. What? Ghosts? You do know ghosts don't exist, right? Oh, this is the forest I was in? That's crazy. Whoa. Hello. You're looking for the boss. I'm afraid he's had a bad day. He took off to get some rest in his lair. Best not to disturb him while he's in that mood. He has a short fuse. Besides, his lair is chock full of booby traps. Anyway, it's up to you. You've been warned. So this is his lair? Alright. Anywhere else to go first? Nah, looks like this is it. <clears throat> we'll save point. Alright, I think I'm gonna leave this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Land. It was a lot of fun. It was very cool. Things got weird. A lot of things happened. And now I'm 3D. Very cool, right? That's so cute. Look at that face. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this, like and subscribe. It means a lot. It helps the channel quite a lot. And let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Session. Section and share, you know, if you guys want. And, uh, yeah, see you guys next time. Hope you guys enjoyed this. And... Stay safe out there. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye,